could he ever conceive that he would be on the precipice of baseball history tonight in this ballpark at this very moment with three outs to go. So with that in mind I'll sit back and watch and you call it. Oh we did it together last time. We're doing it together yeah. again. <laughs> Rodon first pitch breaking ball got a strike an arching strike. Tapper first base side. Abreu is on it. Jose got to the bag. One gone. Will it stand? For me, he's out at first base. I mean, Jose, the only thing he could do was lunge with a foot to first. They're going to take another look at it. And watch the foot. Oh, I think he got there because the first no, hand slid past the bat. He's out at first yes. base. I mean, they're going to look at this as long as they want to. In real time, he was out. And when they look at it, he's still going to be out. The first hand slid past right. the bag and away from the bag. This will stand. If his right hand hit the bag, he's safe. When it went by the bag and the left hand did not beat the leg in and Jose doing his best stretch and dive to the bag. We asked the question earlier today what is your favorite Olympic sport while doing a promo the answer is gymnastics tonight that's an out Steve yeah well I, I thought he was out in real time and I still think he's out and I think after they review it in New York he is still going to be out it's got to stand well it is kind of amazing the call by Brian Knight and he's out and two to go Brilliant play by Jose Abreu, the MVP of the American League last year, just threw a life raft to perfection. Only one move he could have made to get him. The ball was so slowly hit, Carlos couldn't get there, and Jose could do nothing more than to reach out with one leg as if he was sliding into first base to beat him. One down. Carlos Rodon. Roberto Perez. Strike one. Strike two. In 1922, Charlie Robertson threw the fifth perfect game ever. It was the White Sox first. Two more have come thereafter. Oh, and two. Foul back. That was as hard as any fastball he's thrown it was over 98 miles an hour upstairs and Perez was just able to get a piece of it. Now do you risk bearing a slider because Perez will screw himself into the ground after looking at three high fastballs in a row. What would you do. To me I throw him something off speed if, if you feel better with the change up you go with that but. The slider. Carlos has supreme confidence in. The next got to block it. Inside Perez. He got hit by it. Perez got clipped by the slider. Wow. What a way to end the perfect game bid. Carlos is talking to him. He said really can't you. Can't you fake this one? It actually oh, got him off the top of the foot. My goodness. 
Carlos Rodon will not be perfect tonight, but the no hitter is still available. Off the top of the shoe after 25 straight streamlined, crystal clear boxes on a score sheet. Perez off the shoe is on. The no hitter is still alive, and here is Chang. He almost got hit as well, 1 0. Crowd is very unhappy with Perez for not getting out of the way. One ball, one strike. Carlos Rodon has to recalibrate after the first base runner tonight. It's one and two on Chang. Twenty eight years old on a North Carolina state. Carlos Rodon on one and two. Called strike three on the inside corner or in the neighborhood and one out for a no hitter. That was exactly the spot of the called strikeout in the sixth inning. It cut across the plate. It had the inside corner. And he's one out away. Carlos Rodon over the past two seasons of Major League Baseball has thrown in 11 regular season games. First pitch a strike. It has been a nonstop barrage of injuries. Tommy John surgery shoulder trouble seven games in 2019 four last year. And now he faces a menace to lefties. Luplo. One ball, one strike. Two strikes on perspective out number 27. A top notch competitor with baseball in his blood for his entire life. Carlos Rodon on one and two. Upstairs, Carlos was ready to dance. He said, yeah. Luplo said no. He reached back and got 99, the fastest pitch of the night on pitch number 110. Some life in that arm still? You bet. Two and two. At points, Carlos Rodon didn't know, number one, where he'd pitch next, and number two, if he'd pitch next. He's one pitch away from being remembered forever. Two and two. Upstairs. For Lucas Giolito's no hitter, nobody was able to take video in the ballpark. Tonight on three and two. Oh. Luplo smokes it foul off a slider. And Cleveland Steve is really making Carlos Rodon work. You wouldn't expect anything else. Hoping. Believing. Remembering. Focusing. 
three and two. Rodon oh, to third. Moncada. Carlos Rodon has thrown a no hitter. After everything he's been through, the elbow and the shoulder were supreme on April 14th, 2021. So Lucas Giolito last year went from the worst pitcher in baseball to no hitter remembrance forever. Carlos Rodon tonight has gone from I don't know if I'll ever do this again. I don't know if I'll ever get to the level that I wanted to be at to name in a history book forevermore one shoelace away from perfection and you never really know what you're going to see when you have an opportunity to come to the ballpark we saw one last year we see one this year both dominating and this one was something special for Carlos Rodon the game was never in doubt after the first inning the only doubt was would he get the no hitter answered by Montana and what a night. 